talk to anybody. I thought she's being very patient. I was very impressed. Well, they said they kicked me out before the academic corrections. I don't understand that. Like, I'm not saying what she said is right or wrong. I'm just saying she sounded, she sounded really nice. I thought yeah. she didn't sound at all like. I know what people sound like when they're impatient and when they're they're trying to get you off the phone. And she didn't she didn't do that at all. Has she, you've wor you've worked with her before? No, I don't know her. You don't know her? Okay. There's new people in the office. Well, there you go. Maybe that's part of it. But she was very, very, um, I thought she was professional and I thought she was patient and uh, I don't feel as though she was treating you different than she would have treated me if I called her and I had a bunch of questions. She's got a hard job. Nobody wants to tell somebody that their lease isn't renewed, that they have to leave and that they have 30 days to do it. So she did pretty good. Can you imagine having to tell people that? Even if, even if, even if you agree, but say you don't agree. Say somebody comes in your office, your boss, and says, "Amy, you're going to tell this person that they have to leave." You know, it's not an easy job. It ain't an easy job. What you looking for? Okay. Looking for something? No. Cool, because I don't have it. <laughs> I wish Ruby Tuesdays was still here. I would go there today. I loved that restaurant. It was right in the mall. Easy go, easy in, easy out. But yeah, I don't want a lot of food, but I do want some food. I don't have a lot of food in the house at the moment. So tonight I have to go to Wegmans. But from here we're going to Wegmans. And um, I'm just gonna get some pastas and sauces for the pantry. You mean the wagons up there? Yeah. Uh -huh. And then you and I will head on over to the pantry. And we'll load it. And then what do you want to do after that? We'll have some time. We should go to the peninsula. Don't you think? What if it's going to be crowded today? I don't know leave, leave town. Bee's Barbershop. I don't know why they sent me the papers that to oh, get an apartment here. Like, yeah, I wanted to look at them. You didn't bring them with you, or did you? No, because all she said was to initiate my papers and to when I find a landlord to have them sign it. But I already told her, like on the twenty eighth, that I don't want to stay in Erie. That I don't, I don't want to stay here. Yeah. You had asked me one day why my friend doesn't like it in Erie. What friend were you talking about? I don't know. You said one of your friends don't like Erie. That's why I was asking you. Uh oh. That would have probably been Dory who moved here. Oh, Dory. Yeah. She was never wild about it because of the winter. She's not a winter person. Mm -hmm. It is what it is. I am a winter person. So for me, of course, I like it. All right, girl. Let's see. 